every single one. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Marvel Future Fight V630 live stream. We have so much to talk about, the first of which is Thane. Part inhuman, part titan Thane. He is the secret son of Thanos. Thane is a very interesting character, and again, the developers had fun making him as well. But well, this was pretty neat. Thane makes use of both his hands with the quietest beam. After briefly using his right hand to target and freeze enemies, he then uses his left hand to deal damage. When he first got his powers, he lacked control, and this suit was instrumental for it. Mm -hmm. Looks like we're a little bit past when he first gets his powers at this point. Lastly, we have the Amber Undeath. Again, using the power of both his inhuman hands, Thane cast incapacitation on his enemies while improving his ignore target dodge rate. And that, and that does it for the new character, Thane. One of our newly added characters is a mutant, and that is Dazzler. Dazzler is iconic. Allison Ooh. is able to turn sound into light. She's already set to go. You can see just how she rollerblades in. She's ready to school some turkeys on some disco. Next skill which her players will dig, this is the Roller Rainbow Dash. After Whoa. slapping enemies with her funky skates, buffing her stats, she skates away and delivers another blinding light attack from above. Ah, oh, I love her style. But let's move in. Our first new uniform, it's Medusa. Uh, <laughs> her hair is able to be controlled to make her hair expand, pick locks, lift objects. She can do so many things with her hair. We're gonna see some of those things right now when we see her skills. Medusa's fifth skill, which is the Red Whirlwind, incapacitates those and causes paralysis. It also grants benefits such as being able to ignore the target's defenses and also penetrates, you know, damage immunity. There's just so much red. So of course she actually has not, is not just given a new uniform this update, she's given something a little bit new as well. Newly added Awaken skill. Whoa! So after summoning her sister Crystal and her fellow inhuman Miss Marvel, you'll notice attacks such as bleed, freezing, burning. Uh, so in addition, in addition to that, it also reduces the enemy's defenses while also accumulating damage. I love the cameos, especially Ms. Marvel, how she ties in as a, an awakened inhuman from the Terrigen Bomb. And that does it for Medusa. And now let's take a look at our final uniform. In his new Earth X uniform. <laughs> So this yes. uniform actually increases the character's defense and also changes a couple other skills, such as his Silent King and Cosmic Aware Awareness passive skills. But of course, there's one skill everyone, is, of course, is excited to see. The beloved King of the Inhumans has now a T3 ability. So you can see, go ahead and just take a look. Whoa. <laughs> you can see the sounds. It's amazing. Again, all of, every character's T3 is always just fun to watch, whether it be T3 or an Awakening skill. And that does it for the new uniforms and the new character, and of course, the long-awaited T3 for Black Bolt. All right, but that's not all, Cage. That's right. So we do have several different new features. Uh, one of them, uh, one of these features actually relates to the story mission. First, we have alternate mode for the All War story mission. Many of you will remember the All War story mission previous V620 update. But now, similar to the normal story missions in alternate mode, you players now have the ability to select any characters that they like. Secondly, with the alternate mode ultimate, we have uh, established new daily rewards. So one of the items is, of course, a new uniform XP chip, in addition to a new reward referred to as story fragments. The story alternate mode missions for normal and alternate, pure, uh, some new hero biometrics are actually going to be added as well for the reset rewards. So keep an eye out for that. All right, those are all good, but I'm gonna ask you for even more. You want more? Yes. Right, so we do have a little bit more. So as you can see uh, on the screen as well, we have Iceman and we actually have Miss Marvel. These two characters will be getting new uniforms, but they aren't. They won't be live just yet. So the key, these characters are still being tweaked a little bit, but we wanted to try a little something new. We wanted to at least show these characters to you guys so that you guys can just be looking forward to them when they are provided in the next uh, next update. So look for videos on that coming soon to social media. Now moving forward, we're going to be talking about another section that we wanted to show you today, and that is Something appears to be wrong with the stream. <laughs> Greetings, agents. Now I know what you're thinking. Another crazy cage here to hijack your stream. Well, for starters, how about an origin story? One say humble and devastatingly handsome weather reporter. However, the weather botched my newscast and ruined my reputation. Days later, thanks to the Terrigen Mist, I became something more. Now, 
suppose address me as... With these seemingly useless powers, I found that I've actually transcended over other broadcasters. That's right. I've gained the ability to see every single comment on social media. Every. Single. One. Facebook. Twitter. Reddit. I see it all. Try to leave a comment. Trust me. I'll see it. Think about it. Which would you rather listen to? This? We're on the case. So if you see him. And a jerk. Yes. <laughs> or this. Next up on the list is the Rainbow Roller Dash. Where this funky cat schools turkeys and then roller blades straight into your paws. So Cajun Kim, you have a choice. Surrender the stream to us cages or we'll take it by force. Until then, I'll see you next time, agents. Can you hear? Oh, you can. Okay, great. It's back. All right, everyone. Goodbye, agents. And until Bye. next time. <laughs> We're still doing here. Expecting a sneak peek for the next update. Don't count on it. Go on. <laughs>